now keeping you and your family safe. This is Two Works For You Weather, certified most accurate. Hey, and this morning we've been keeping an eye on the roads across the city of Tulsa, much of northeast Oklahoma dealing with the same problem. We're seeing a lot of rainfall out there. And here's a live look from Storm Chaser 2 out and about across the Tulsa metro area on some of those highways and some of the city streets. And you can tell it is not only wet out there, but also the visibilities are reduced with that rain still falling across the city of Tulsa. So be very careful out there. And you notice also a little bit of construction. So all of those things combined could give you some problems this morning on your way into work. So be careful there. We have a brand new flash flood warning. It's in effect for Tulsa County, Washington, Nawada, also parts of Craig and Rogers County. That runs until 2 p.m. Most of the rest of these flash flood warnings, especially south and east of Tulsa over to northwest Arkansas, run until the late morning hours. And with more rain on the way to eastern Oklahoma, it looks like some of those could be extended into the afternoon as well. Viper 2 HD, very active, the heaviest of the rain from Muskogee to Pryor. All this lifting off to the north, and this goes all the way down into central areas of Texas. So we'll see a slow shift of this this activity to the east while the main batch itself will lift north and east. Hopefully we'll start to dry things out here as we head through the afternoon hours, but it looks like the rain could stick around, especially Tulsa to the east for most of the day today with this big upper level storm system taking its time. It's going to take several days to finally move east of the Tulsa area, and until it does, we're going to see chances of rain and storms continuing. 54 right now in the city with high humidity levels. It is cool area wide, so not only will you need the umbrella, you'll probably need a jacket around as well. Rain continues through the morning into the afternoon. Afternoon hours, heaviest of the rain trying to push off to the east. Could see a few strong to severe storms in far eastern Oklahoma and western Arkansas through the afternoon. Hail and high winds will be the main threats. We'll dry things out just a bit overnight, about a 50 50 chance of rain and storms overnight and again for tomorrow. And we'll bump that chance of rain up a little bit more though as we move on into our Thursday. As a good chance of rain for today, we'll keep the lingering chances going for Wednesday and Thursday. Then this weekend, finally some sunshine returning with highs back in the 70s. So if we make it to the end of the week, we're going to get some rain relief. That's right. Just focus on that weekend. That's right. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. You got it.